I've tried everything to get these wrinkles out. I've tried ironing it, laying it flat. It's gotta be something better that I can build. How about we go from this to this? Stick around if you wanna see how I built this ultimate home DIY putting green. I can change the slope so you can be putting uphill or downhill. I can add little features underneath the turf so that you can put some break into the putts. It's got five different holes, one of them even a small challenge hole. I think you'll really enjoy this build. I was lucky enough to get a few cups from my golf course, uh, but these are regulation cups. You can see how wonderfully green they are on the inside. I might give them a bit of a clean, but you know, they were well loved last season. Um, but as a regulation cup, they're six inches tall. Now I'm not even gonna bother using flags. So what I thought is I could cut a couple inches off the bottom and this should be three and a half plus three quarters. So I have about four and a quarter inches to work with. So I'm gonna set up a little jig on my bandsaw and just take some of the waste off of the bottom and then still have the full depth so that I can roll a bunch of balls into these cups.
Well, this is why I need the indoor putting surface. Um, today, really cold out, really cold in my garage. You can see my breath. Uh, so I'm gonna take this inside, set it up in my basement. I have my indoor turf already, and I'm gonna do all the cutting and everything inside where it's a little bit warmer than it is right now. Carpet is on. The front is being held on here with these magnets. It just kind of holds it up in place. And now I have some Velcro. It comes in a long continuous tape and I'm going to put it underneath at the left and the right sides, past the holes to really hold down the carpet. So I'm hoping I can kind of pull it, put a little tension on it, Velcro it down and make it perfect. Hole. I cut and drywall. Go to the edge. I'm just gonna follow it. Beautiful. see with this taper if I insert it underneath here the grass is just going to gently ride up and give you a little bit of an edge so there's some break to your putts. I can place this right here. I can feel it right underneath there so some of these putts are just going to break off of that on their way to the hole. Let's check it out. 